Yo, what's up, TriNFD? We're here bringing you another video today with Eric, of course. What's good, Tri family? What's up, what's up? Today we're gonna be doing a little DIY with the girl over here. We're gonna be painting this girl glossy black. Glossy black, and we're gonna be using these right here. The glossy black from AutoZone. We got the clear coat over here. Got to see that. And then we got the 400 sanding paper. But wait, Carlos, why are you painting your grill? Because I got this sick mod coming in that's gonna match the grill. And maybe a little new bumper added too, who knows? Maybe a little splitter. Yeah. No. So stay tuned. No, who knows? Stay no, no, tuned. no, who knows? I'm liking the splitter action. Carlos knows my opinion. I've already seen what he's gonna do, so I've kind of opinionated on what's gonna be going on. But uh, all I'm gonna say is, uh, this is one small step for it, for something pretty big. So just wait, just wait. All right, so we're gonna teach you guys how to take this girl out, and I'll be right back. All right, so to take out the girl, there's gonna be four clips. One, two, three, and four. And there's gonna be a little bit, a couple clips inside. Eric, if you wanna hold the camera. All right, I'll hold so you guys can show him. All right, so look, this clip right here, Another clip, and then there's two more at the other end. Let me see if I can get it to focus. So this one right here. You just pop these out, and this whole grill, this whole front end should come out. Those clips right there, guys. Focus on that. There we go. Those clips right there, there's four of them lined against uh, against the grill. All you, all you need to do is just pop those off. So after you pop these off right here on top, there's gonna be a couple more. There's gonna be two here, two there, just going across the grill. Literally, all you do is just pop those off and then your grill comes off. So, it's we're gonna get to doing that right now. Pretty easy process. Yeah, it's not crazy hard. It does not take a, like a full mechanic to do this. Anybody can do this at home, so. Uh, Again, this is the products that we're using. Yeah, shout out to, to AutoZone. They always <laughs> put us on with older supplies. We, we obviously got the P400 sandpaper. Make sure you guys get the right one. You don't wanna mess anything up. And then we got our clear coat and the paint we're gonna use. So, so all of them, please, please sponsor me. <laughs> Low key. Money. College student. We would not mind. 2020. The sponsors, but uh, yeah. So we're gonna go get this done real quick and you guys will see it as soon as it's off. All right guys, so we got the girl off the car. Damn dog, you see my turbos? Little spinny boy hiding in there. See so the focus on the spinny boy. Sick boys, nah, that's just the Big ass horns. gap in there. Just the horns. All right, so. I want to show you guys how to actually take out these clips without breaking them. So I already broke one, which is over here. Oops. And happens, happens. this part right here is going to be facing this way. So give them a little POV view action. POV, POV. So it's going to be pointing this way. What you want to do is take your pliers and take the middle part and you're going to want to twist it downwards and this clip is going to come out easily. And be careful with these two clips because if these don't come out properly, you can snap these and the grill won't connect back to your car. So yeah. these clips are very important at the end. Make sure you yeah, make sure you be careful with those because we don't want any of these to break. We already broke one by accident, but Yeah, but this one's not really as bad as these boys up here. Yeah. So next what problem. we're gonna go do is give it a little wash before we sand it down. Yep. So we're gonna be using our Rev Auto Supply. Link in the description. Go course, check out their course. website. Always use our sponsors. Go support them. Discount code trying to have the uh, checkout. Yes, sir. So let's go get this bad boy washed. Choose your fighter. Fight. 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 Alright guys, so we're back after washing the grill. Squeaky clean, a little wet still. But I'm gonna teach you guys how to take out the emblem. 
We're gonna be painting just the grill, not the emblem, because I think, personally, it wouldn't match the theme I'm going for. Yeah. So, in order to take out the emblem, there's gonna be little two clips right here. Bend them back. Literally, you can use your hand. And then, voila. Boom. Infinity's gone. Straight forward, and now. And now, boom. we're gonna sand. You ready, Eric? You sir, I got that P400, boys. I'm gonna sand this down, and then we'll start with the coats. So, till then. Also, people the G looks. It's so mean. Like, this bitch, oh, it looks like she's smiling. With, like, no teeth. Yeah, she has, like, some gaps. That. So, we'll be back. Gotta go sand this down real quick. So, this is what the outcome after sanding is. You guys can't really feel it, obviously, but it's actually really smooth. Um, That's the gap of the Infinity logo. But, uh, yeah, it came out pretty smooth. As you can see, we kind of just did it right here. We used two little things, of, well, about like three things of sanding paper. It came with five, so overall not too shabby, but uh, now we're gonna go wash this down, remove all the stuff that's left on it, all the flakes and whatnot, and then afterwards, we're gonna start with our three layers of primer, and uh, yeah, we'll go from there, so yeah. All right. All right, guys, so after washing the grill, we're gonna be spray painting it with this for the third time showing you guys again. So for the first coat, we're gonna be going light. So come over here, Eric. I wanna stay pretty far away and just go light. These are these are like the porn hub. Uh, yeah, the wind POVs. is blowing. <laughs> yeah, but. Very light, the very first coat. As SpongeBob would say, technique. Technique. Also, one more thing, boys. Uh, we don't have masks, so we're gonna die. Ghetto up. style. Do one of these bitches and cover up. Boys cannot get high off this. I mean. It's for your first coat, you want to go very light. Your second coat, you can go a little bit more. And your third coat, just spray that bitch on. Like I said, we're not teaching you guys. You're just watching us struggle. Yeah. <laughs> we look like dumb fucks out here. We, we would have a blanket out, a fucking jack box, and then the grill itself. So. Yeah. Yeah, and it's windy, so oh, yeah. it's blowing. Florida right now is pretty windy. Like yeah. the sky's kind of nice right now, but it's fairly we're windy. To finish this before the sun goes down. Yeah, so. and it's pretty fucking windy. So uh, we're gonna finish up maybe this layer and keep you guys posted after we do a, a couple more, so we don't bore you to death just doing the same thing over and over again. So yeah, this is the b a little like before. So I'm gonna show you guys how it looks before, and yeah, we'll show you guys after. Eight hours later. All right, guys. So we're on our second to last coat. It looks pretty nice, pretty nice. It's coming along good. And after this, we're gonna spray three coats of the clear coat, which is gonna be over here. All right, so here's the clear coat. So we're basically gonna do the same thing as we did the black spray paint. We're gonna start with one coat light, and then we're gonna do second coat medium and third coat heavy. And we're gonna put this grill on the G, and then I'm gonna show you how it looks. So I'll catch you guys then. All right, guys. So it's the second day. As you can see, the sun's back out. Eric's nowhere to be found. So I'm actually doing this by myself right now. I'm on the second coat of glossy clear coat. I'm about to do my third coat. Again, you wanna spray evenly, not too much. All right, <clears throat> here you go. I'm probably gonna do one more coat and we're gonna put this on the bumper, see how it looks. Yo, I am so excited to show you guys how clean this grill came out. Like, it looks like it's meant to be on the car, man. You guys ready to see it? Boom, look at that. Now it's time to go take pictures of the car. And if you guys don't follow our Instagram, make sure you follow it, at TrinFD. They're the first to get everything. So if you guys want a sneak peek of anything, go look at TrinFD's Instagram. But look how clean that came out. That's extremely good. I'm proud. Now it's time for the headlights. Oh, oops, spoiled it. <laughs> no, but that's it for this video. Make sure you guys comment, subscribe, and like. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace, Tri family. Yeah, one A, two A, three A, four.
that's that shit I might adore 44, I'm keeping two in my back door Making these bitches trip while I'm mopping the floor I will lure any prey to my front door While I stir, I'm mixing up pressure, it's a cure Drop on my call